So you have a refrigerator freezer that came with an ice maker, um, but you can't use it because you're in an apartment that doesn't allow you to hook up to the main line. So you can't use those features. Or so you thought. The ice maker you can still use if you have a refrigerator like I do. This is a pretty old one. So there's no, there's nothing in the door, but it has an ice maker inside and I can put that in, take that out and you can actually unplug it and plug it back in right there. It's very easy. So you can see that I've got ice, it's making ice. But what you do is you have to fill it manually. That's, that's, all, that's all you have to do. So what I do, is I figured out that my ice maker um, takes a turkey baster worth of water. And so I just fill that up at the faucet. I come over here and it helps me. I can, lean, I can you know, stre stretch all the way back there. To the, that's the back where it fills and then I'll slowly squeeze it all in there. And then in about half an hour, you know, everything functions and then it dumps out some ice. And then if I'm very diligent, then I can put more in and keep it going. So if you just, you know, you can, you can still use it. Um, doesn't have to be too high tech. You just have to maintain it. You're welcome.